I'm all ears. Found the route the Morningstar uses to deliver their goods buried in the syndicate files. You saying we drop a few pipe bombs under them? Fuck that. I'm saying we use a tank. This may be the best idea you ever had. Steal some other losers' wheels! We already were. Oh, not like this. You've been personally selected for a spot on a game show here in town. Game show? You're not trying to auction me off on some kind of dating thing, are you? Trust me, you'll love this shit. Meet me and I'll show you. You better be right. Steelport, and welcome to Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax. Time to see how the game is played. Fight your way through Professor Genki's Super Sparkle Lab for fun and profit. Now, with every man, woman, and tiger shot, your prize money goes up. But look out, no one likes it when you shoot a pan on it. Unethical. Once you've collected enough money, the door to the lab opens up and you're free to go. But if you think it's that easy, you've never seen Kinky before. Oh, and one more thing. On this show, no one gets to take a break. If you want to stay in the fight, be sure to shoot the first aid target. Good luck. It's murder time and fun time. Welcome to Professor Genki's Super Ethical Reality Climax. Murder time is fun time, right, Bobby? You got it, Zach. If our contestants can survive the deadly traps, armed mascots, and those freakishly huge hunters, they can win a hefty pile of cash. 
This game looks deadly because it is, <laughs> but it's still probably safer than driving in Steelport. <laughs> Our competitor isn't from Steelport this time, Zach. Today we'll be watching the leader of the Saints, the world famous Stillwater Street Gang. As many times as this former gangbanger has been shot at, blown up, run over, and generally put through hell, this competition probably <laughs> seems pretty routine. Uh, routine maybe, but lucrative. You are going to make Professor Yankee sized dollars driving hose around, that's for sure. Oh, cha -ching. This is quickly becoming a performance for the record books. Apparently, our contestant is quite the hero back in Stillwater. Have you ever been to Stillwater, Bobby? I did, and it wasn't a good trip. My car got covered in sewage by a passing septic truck. <laughs> really? What did you do to piss off the driver? I didn't do a damn thing. I just wish I hadn't rented a convertible. Wait, you were in the car when this happened? Back to the action. Our contestant is doing really well. Hope the money is worth this. <laughs> That's what the fans pay to see. Like sticking a fork in a oh. socket. The Saints Capo is having no trouble with this arena. And that's it! We have a winner!